Hi guys, my name is Mitz and I'm going to show you how to change your text size on your computer. Now, there's a few different ways to do it. So the first one I'm going to show you is um, on a website. So just say you're reading a website and you want to enlarge the text. So we'll go to the internet. Okay, now just say that this text isn't big enough for you. So what we're going to do is hold down the control button on your keyboard and also use the scroll um, wheel on your mouse. Okay, now what that does, you can just go back and forth and see which, um, how big do you want it. Okay, and then you stop. Now you can keep going and go overboard. Okay, um, now I'll just go back to normal. Um, and you can go really tiny, yeah, and that's how easy it is. It's very simple. So you're pressing the control key and your scroll um, wheel, you're moving that up and down on your mouse. Okay, now um, another way is. I'll take you to the desktop, so we'll put that down the bottom by pressing this minimize. Okay, now we'll go to the desktop, which is the blank space, and we're going to right click and press personalize. Now I'm actually using Windows Vista Home Premium for this, so it should be available on anything above that. Um, I'm not too sure about Windows Vista Home Basic. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to press on adjust font size. There we go, right there. Okay, and now it'll give you a choice to up the size there. So let's just change it. And it says this change will take effect after the restart. Um, you can also change it to a custom one. Now at the moment I just put it up to 125% but you can go more okay just press OK and see how it's got another choice there now and actually I'm just going to press it back to here but um, if I did make a choice I'd press OK and apply and it'd make the change after I restart okay but I didn't actually change it so I'm just going to press restart later all right um, I hope that helps to show you a different, uh, couple of different ways on how to resize your text. Alright, thanks for watching.